Hello everyone, welcome to my The Young and the Restless Homies official channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. The Young and the Restless spoilers suggest that Diane Jenkins Abbott would encourage Kyle Abbott to return to Jabbar as an interim CEO and then take over Billy Abbott's co-CEO role when he is inevitably forced out again. Kyle, on the other hand, is concerned about being cast in a supporting role and always being in Jack Abbott's shadow. Billy will brief Jack on his conversation with Tucker McCall, who, despite his calm demeanor, is worried over the blackmail threat. Billy will be skeptical of Jack's suggestion that Phyllis assist them in discovering what Tucker is up to. Although Jack will be aware of this, he will also be aware of Phyllis's desire to be accepted once more. Jack will hope Tucker will back down because of the blackmail, but he will indicate that they will use Phyllis as a backup plan. When Jack returns home, he'll make his own plea for Kyle's return to Jabbat. Kyle will wind up listening in on Diane's conversation with Jack about how they need to help Kyle feel valued in the home and at work. Tucker will interrupt Audra Charles' conversation with Nikki Newman at Society, but Audra will say she doesn't have time to talk right now. Tucker will text Adam Newman a threat after Audra leaves with Nikki. Adam will enjoy getting under Tucker's skin after he reads a message saying he will regret it. In Victor Newman's office, Adam will persuade his father that Victoria Newman is the Newman he should be concerned about. Victor will appear to have things under control and will make it plain that disloyalty will not be tolerated. Later, at Society's Bar, Adam will speak with Tucker, who will confront him about the evidence he clearly provided Billy. Despite Adam's denials, Tucker insists Adam made him an enemy and that he's soon to see what a huge mistake it was. At the park, Nick Newman, Joshua Morrow, will lose it over Sally Spectra's kiss confession and believe Adam exploited her. Sally will tell the account of what happened after Adam drove her back to her room after a nice supper that involved a bit too much alcohol. Nick will act as though Adam made a deliberate move while he was out of town, but Sally will defend Adam and tell out that he appeared truly sorry. Nick, of course, will not believe it for a second, but he will want to know how Sally felt after the kiss. This will lead to Sally admitting she is conflicted, leading Nick to believe she is still in love with Adam. Sally will explain that it's similar to Nick's connection with Sharon Rosales and that you can't just turn those feelings off, but Nick will disagree. Although Sally will insist that she is only friends with Adam, Nick will believe she is either lying to herself or not telling him the truth. Nick will suggest that Sally's residual feelings for Adam are the source of the barrier in their own relationship but Sally will argue that she loves what she's built with Nick and hopes she hasn't messed it up. Adam will appear and waltz over when Nick pulls Sally into a hug. As a result of Nick's furious reaction, Adam swiftly deduces that Sally must have told him about the kiss. On Tuesday's episode of Y and R, Nate Hastings will inform Victoria that Victor is suspicious of Adam's quick turnaround. Victoria will be relieved, but Nate will admit that Victor seemed suspicious of her rapid change of heart as well. Nate will wonder if Victoria truly meant what she said about accepting Victor's adjustments. Victoria will claim that she is going along with Victor's intentions for the time being and that her efforts to stay on good terms with him are genuine. Victoria will indicate to Adam that it may require him doing something destructive to the firm for Victor to reach his breaking point. When Nikki meets with Victor at Newman Enterprises, he will reassure her about his health and the harmony he hopes to achieve. Victor will overhear Victoria discussing Nick's desire to return at some point. Audra will appear in Tucker's apartment to find out what he wanted to talk to her about earlier. Tucker will reveal that there is a problem that Audra will have to assist him in resolving. After Tucker informs Audra that Adam sent incriminating material to Billy, she will assume Adam's plan to leave after Jabbat is completed. Audra will be left wondering what Tucker will do next. According to the young and the restless spoilers, Tucker has a few more tricks up his sleeve, so stay tuned. According to the young and the restless spoilers for Tuesday, October 3, 2023, Jack Abbott tries to persuade Kyle Abbott to return to Jabbat. Victor Newman promises Nikki Newman something. Highlights from The Young and the Restless Plus, Victoria Newman compares notes with Nate Hastings. Continue reading to find out what happens in the next episode of the CBS soap opera. I and R Spoilers 
jab it higher. According to Y and R teasers, Nikki offered Claire Grace a job as an assistant at Newman Media. Despite her dislike for Claire, Audra Charles understood better than to dispute Nikki's decision. However, Newman Media will not be the only company looking to hire someone fresh. Over at Jabut, Jack tries to persuade Kyle to rejoin the family firm. Will Kyle agree to return despite having been fired and dumped? After all, Jack and Kyle must deal with some family matters. Spoilers for the young and the restless. Victor Newman's promise. Victor might still be thinking about Victoria's groveling. Victor said to himself that everyone joining so soon seems odd. Victor, on the other hand, has a long-term strategy in place. As a result, Victor may express his concerns to Nikki. It is also hinted that Victor will make a vow to Nikki. Nikki will be anxious that Victor would permanently damage family bonds, particularly with his children, so perhaps Victor will vow to shut it down if things get out of hand. Victoria Newman compares notes on Y and R. Victoria made peace with Victor, according to the Young and the Restless spoilers for Tuesday, October 3. Victoria, on the other hand, clearly disagrees with Victor's recent business moves, especially following Adam Newman's elevator words. After that scene, it was evident that Victoria had a plan. Nate and Victoria are said to share notes on Tuesday's episode. Following that, the two might discuss how to deal with Victor and Adam. Spoilers for The Young and the Restless, Tuesday, October 3. Fans may also watch how Nick Newman reacts to Sally Spectra's revelation on Tuesday, October 3. What does the future hold for Nick's relationship with Sharon Rosales? What does Nick's decision to seek guidance from Sharon indicate for his relationship with Sally? Which plotline are you most excited to watch on Tuesday, October 3? Please leave your comments in the section below. Keep watching the soap opera on CBS or Paramount Plus to find out what happens next. Make sure to stay up to date on what Y&R is doing right now. Return frequently to get the young and the restless spoilers, news, and updates. Sally Spectra will think her relationship with Nick Newman can survive their recent setback, according to the young and the restless spoilers on Wednesday, October 4, but Nick will say he's hit his limit when it comes to Adam Newman trying to come between them. When Sally asks if they're okay, Nick won't know and will need time to analyze the kiss as well as Sally's remaining feelings for Adam. Sally may always harbor affections for her ex, which Nick must determine whether he can live with. Nick will seek advice from Sharon Rosales as he considers his future with Sally. Sharon will most likely receive updates on Sally's confession and the fact that Adam has once again become a source of contention in her relationship with Nick. Sharon will console Nick and offer some sound counsel, so he'll reflect on her words of wisdom and try to figure out if his romance can survive. Other Y and R spoilers indicate that Sally will confront Adam about lying, implying that they will have some heated exchanges. Sally will notice Adam's dishonesty and may question if Nick was correct about him trying to make a move when his brother was abroad. Regardless, the new and improved Adam will no longer appear credible if his lie is exposed, and Sally may feel that trusting him is a mistake. Mamie Johnson will next attend a family meeting with Lily Winters, Devin Hamilton Winters, and Nate Hastings to discuss her plans. Mamie will explain more about her motivations after her Chancellor Winters investment is confirmed, and she hopes that this is the beginning of a new method of bonding with her family. Mamie may apologize for her concealment and claim that she needed to get all her ducks in an order before coming clean. According to the Young and the Restless spoilers, Jill Abbott will be skeptical of Mamie's intentions, so expect her to lash out over the news by midweek. So what do you guys think about this update? Let me know in the comments below. And if you like my videos, please press like and subscribe for more. I'll see you guys next time.